What's up, YouTube? T-Movies here. Well, it's reported that two of my favorite actors, Rob De Niro and Shia LaBeouf, are teaming up for an upcoming film titled After Exile. The film will be directed by Joshua Stern, who also directed the Action Kutcher film, uh, Jobs, where Kutcher played uh, Steve Jobs, which I thought was an okay film. I know lots of people poo-poo on that one, but I don't feel like that Jobs movie. Anyway, uh... The film will be produced by Anthony Dorn and uh, Steve Steiner of uh, Pacific Shore uh, Films. And here's what the film's about. After Exile is the story of Mike Delaney, played by LaBeouf, who, after being released from prison for killing an innocent man after a violent robbery, must re-enter his own life, where he and his ex-criminal father, played by De Niro, attempt to save his younger brother's life from a... Where they try to save his, uh, you know, brother's life from a uh, life of drugs and crime and all. The drama is also about a uh, the difficult, uh, trajectory um, towards forgiveness and redemption. De Niro will play uh, Ted Delaney, who's a uh, ex-con who like lost his wife years ago, and now suffers from alcoholism and guilt. And all he has left uh, is the instant to uh, save his uh, two sons from the dark and the destructive. Uh, past they are on together, and that sounds awesome. I mean, I do love me a good redemption story and stuff like that. I'm in. I mean, you got Robert De Niro and Shia LaBeouf starring ch together in this. Saw me up there. I mean, you know, I I've been saying this for a while. You know, despite him being cuckoo and all, like. I'm not going to lie, Shia LaBeouf is a cuckoo guy, but, wait, wait till this, uh, all right, so, okay. anyway, uh, as I was saying, um, LaBeouf is, you know, a cuckoo guy, but the guy is actually a really terrific actor, and, you know, pairing him up with, uh, a Rob De Niro, sign me up there, you know, uh, Rob De Niro is, of course, arguably my favorite actor of all time, and, Seeing uh, De Niro and uh, LaBeouf, you know, teaming okay. together in this, sign me up, and yeah, I think this could be something really interesting. And not to mention, Rob De Niro and Shia LaBeouf are also, like, they have a few other projects in line, in, um, in the pipeline as well. Like, Shia LaBeouf would next be, uh, he could, of course, be seen now in the Peanut Butter Falcon, which I cannot wait to see. And he'll also be seen in the upcoming drama Honey Boy, uh, the David Ayer film The Tax Collector. And a film called Rothschild, where he'll team up with Mel Gibson. So, Mel Gibson and Shia LaBeouf, too. Wow. And uh, Rob De Niro, he'll next be seen in DC's Joker movie with uh, Joaquin Phoenix. Uh, he's also in Mars Scorsese's uh, film The Irishman, which is coming to Netflix. Uh, he's also in a comedy called uh, The Comeback tri uh, trial, uh, trail with uh, Morgan Freeman and Tom Lee Jones. He's also in a family comedy called uh, The War with Grandpa, which was supposed to get released by... Uh, uh, which was supposed to get released by uh, the Weinstein Company, but you guys know that story. And uh, he's also in the film called uh, Killers of the uh, Fire Moon with uh, Leo DiCaprio. So, hey, anything Robert De Niro's in, I'll give a watch because I'm a big De Niro guy. And, you know, De Niro and uh, LaBeouf teaming up, saw me up there. So, this sounds like it could be really interesting. But let me leave you guys. Uh, what are your thoughts on Robert De Niro and Shia LaBeouf teaming up together for After Exile? Uh, do, um, are you a fan of them both? Do you like the sound of this? Uh, drop a comment below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for more notifications. This here is C Movies signing off.